Guys, it's been a long time since we've done this. I'm just gonna start that off here. As you guys see here in Oklahoma, we got yet again another snow. God, just about died. Most of it has melted off and it's gone. Um, I'm not going into town today, so this video is probably gonna be like a two day part. I'm out here getting blinded right now too. Dear God, I'm glad I have this tin advisor. I give it probably another day or two before I ride this thing into town just because the roads in town and whatnot are literally full of salt and sand and I don't know I don't really have a good feeling about riding a motorcycle and all that so we're just not gonna do it play it safe I would have had a video out by now but I refuse to upload yet another vlog um, that's not like a moto vlog um, I just didn't want to put some more boring content out there because I know the past two videos have not been very entertaining at all and I am sorry for that guys but I couldn't leave you guys hanging and I had to show you guys the Grom, had to show it off a little bit, had to keep you guys posted and whatnot so that's what we did. So here she be guys, um, I need to mess with that number plate some more because it is a tiny bit crooked, but we ain't gonna get that perfect anyways. It's no big deal. But, she's out in the wilderness. You guys aren't seeing her in my backyard anymore. Um, been running with the headlight on just to make sure that like everything runs the way it should where my butt doesn't catch on fire randomly or something. But, it seems to be doing just fine. We do have a fuse running off the battery from for that light. So, <sighs> should be fine. I don't know guys when it comes to that stuff I really don't know a lot about electrical stuff I'm gonna be the first one to come out and say it before my friends do um, I just uh, you know that ain't my strong point I'm not gonna lie about it look how muddy this crap is look at that that's disgusting we're gonna take I literally just sunk right there we're gonna get out of here before we get stuck I bet my my back's gonna be disgusting now. It's gonna throw it all over me. I just had to get out and uh, you know make sure this thing's running all right before I commit to filming a full video. So this is probably gonna be like the little intro to tomorrow's video, if you will. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Also, this thing fell over in the shed yesterday. These uh, IMS shifters bend ridiculously easy. I learned that. It fell on this side of it yesterday. And this shifter got bent in like past this case. So, I mean, I know that's like 200 and something pounds, almost 300 pounds falling of like dead weight. But dude, that was one fall. I couldn't imagine like what an actual fall like 50 miles an hour would do. Just had to throw it out there. Other than that, I do love this shifter though. It feels way better than my other one. Who is that? Time out. That's my cousin's house down there. I'm making sure ain't nobody trying nothing slick with your pretty little Tequache truck. Is that what they call them? Tequaches? I'm about to go see what they want. What are you saying? One sec, I can't hear you. Oh, man, I'm sorry about that. No, you're good. It's just hard to hear. Oh, I know. What's up? How you doing? Hey, am I across the river here? What side of the river do you need to be on? What side of the river? Prattville or like Sands Main side? You need to be on the east side of the river. So like Prattville? Yeah, Prattville. Okay, no. no I'm on the you have to go back down 97, like past the casino. You know where that's at? Dude, you're gonna shoot all the way in there. I saw but, you with your bike going back and forth. I said, this guy probably lives here. <laughs> no, that's my cousin's down there. But yeah, just shoot back on the highway. You should be good. Take it easy, man. 
seemed like it was just a contractor lost contractor of some sort he didn't speak he spoke english but not very good there was somebody on the phone with him trying to explain where he was trying to go like a homeowner or something it sounded like he was some kind of contractor so i work around those guys i know they get lost all the time i know i know how it goes not a big deal <laughs> anywho as i was saying guys tune in tomorrow to um see the rest of this video it'll be like one second for you it is time it is the next day it's even nicer outside so without further ado we're gonna get back on the road we're gonna go into town take a little stroll this is a beautiful day I got some things I want to talk about. I got some things I need to update you guys about. A lot's happened. Like, it's literally been a minute since I've just gotten to ride and talk. And, uh, kind of give you guys a little life update, if you will. God. Just pulled out of my neighborhood and we're already getting swerved at. Off to a great start. Dear God, man. So obviously, I've been a little MIA. I just don't want to be the guy to like throw out content that is just like stupid vlog stuff that is not entertaining at all and nothing you want to see because I know it's not. Like, let's face it, I'm not dumb. I'm aware that people want to see like action pass stuff on the road and I don't blame you I would too had to I just don't want to like throw out stuff that isn't like quality content I would rather just throw out a bunch of quality stuff that is really entertaining with a bunch of action in it a bunch of stuff that goes down whatever than like just chunk out some stuff just to get it out and I've done it obviously like there's videos out there on my channel that literally have like 20 something views and that's why during slow times of the year like it has been these past couple months now where it's cold outside people don't really ride much um you know that's kind of i'm gonna have to figure something out there whether it's like vlog stuff or whether i'd make some kind of compilation of some sort like i'm gonna have to figure something out obviously but we aren't even like a year into this we're barely over half a year into this i don't even know if we're into that far i don't even know how long it's been I don't even think it's been half a year. I don't know. Either way, it's gonna take time. I'm gonna have to figure out what works for me. And that's just as simple as that. I shouldn't have came down this road, dog. You guys see all this sand? This is terrifying. We're going left. Dude, salt. Don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die. <laughs> so much sand. Anyways. All I really wanted to get at here was like, don't think that there isn't like a bunch of stuff to still come. Cause like getting this thing done is like just the start of it in all reality. I'm really, 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 really excited this thing's done. It's not all the way done, but we're getting there. But we're gonna pull up here. And the recent thing I've started doing actually is, um like journaling sort of kind of I just like writing I always have I've never like actually physically gotten into writing I've always like all right this is like a deep fact about me so just know that I'm like spilling my own beans right now I've always really like been able to get a lot off my chest I guess maybe something like that I don't know what I'm trying to say like it's hard to put into words like I've always been able to uh, I guess open the mind a little more if you will like if that makes any sense at all like that's the best way I can put it into words I don't know how to explain it it's really weird to explain I always went and like wrote in the notes on my phone just like typed and typed and typed and typed forever until like you know, I felt better about whatever the situation may be or whatever I might be dealing with personally, whatever, you know, like, I'll just go write about it. And, uh, 
you know whether it's my day or whether it's something actually going on like whatever it is i would just go right and like every i don't know i always notice like it really really helped me just like being able to go back and read and like look back to see where i've come you know what i mean i think that's like why i've always thought it was so cool just because i've always been able to like go look back at all those things and like kind of see where i was at and what point you know what i mean and that's something i've been doing is just kind of taking some time out of my day to go just ride a little bit you know don't forget your light noah that's something i'm gonna have to get used to during the day i don't really need to be running with it on but i get a sense of security that like people can see me better when i have it on <laughs> So guys, I'm headed back to the house. I didn't do much today. It's honestly a lot more chilly than I thought it was gonna be, otherwise I would've rode around some more. But this weekend, Friday, I know for certain it's supposed to be like a high of like 70 something. And then it's dropping back down on like on the low 50s this weekend, of course. Of course, I know. But I'm gonna pump this video out this week go film a video Friday get it that ready for next week and then I think slowly but surely it's gonna start warming up I think you never know because I mean look at the ground you literally never know in Oklahoma we are back we are back in the normal swing of things the Grom seems to be doing just fine I don't know what these noises are I'm hearing but I'm really not concerned about them Grom is running really really good I need to change the oil sometime this week before Friday preferably um, and then after that, we'll be good to go. It was a small one. That's my first Willy in over a month, guys. As I said, I hope you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, leave a like. If you aren't subscribed, drop a sub for me. Leave some comments. Let me know what you guys want to see. Let me know what you guys want to see out of this thing. Let me know what you guys want to see on this thing. Anything. Let me know. I'm open to everything. So as always, you guys keep it real. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.